Hi, my lovely Scorpio. Welcome to your reading for month of November 2020 by Maya Inca Oracle. My name is Jelka. I'm Croatian Psychic and Tarot Card Reader in Vancouver, BC. My dear Scorpio, here on the table we have Tarot Card Spread for you guys for this month. And this month we have Celtic Spread. Uh, but before I start reading your cards, I would like to take a chance to apologize for not being in connection and communication with you for a certain period because of technical reason. But things have been changed and we are back now again and we're going to be offering each month regular um, monthly reading for each zodiac sign in English and in Croatian as well. But for now we're not going to be having um, private readings because we of the time. We are so busy and we don't have time for that. But we're going to have regular monthly reading for each zodiac sign. Except private reading for now. A mighty Scorpio, <clears throat> I would like to take a chance as well uh, to welcome you back again um, to my site and start with reading. Your first card, the card that represents your situation this month is a six of wands. And this is very very good card for you, good energy for you. Uh, you are in position this month uh, to be recognized for your work, for what you are and who you are. Um, by, by people around you, you are on a horse, you are sitting here, you are, um, there is celebration, you are celebrated by other people, you are recognized, they like you, love you, and they uh, give you, hon they are honoring you. So this is great energy for you this month. You have success and recognition this month. Uh, what is, um, <coughs> card, which card, this card can um, cross you or support you. This card is supporting you this month, and there is Knight of Swords, Knight of, Knight of Swords, um, that you're going to be receiving some important news. Somebody is really um, eager to bring you some information that is going to be supporting you as well. And um, it's going to be good things for you. So news are supporting you, some news. Knight is supporting you, Knight of Swords. And the card that is underlying energy for this month for you guys is Three of Cups. Um, you, you can expect this month to be... Um, all this month woven with celebration, uh, with things like that, and uh, parties and coming together and friendship and uh, yeah, so you can be uh, expect um, coming together with other people and celebrating something that is um, energy for this month, underlying energy. And what is getting out of your space is um, confusion, confusion and um, seven of cups, of seven of cups. So um, you probably decided about something. This is when you have lots of choices, lots of things to choose, and you cannot, like, maybe you, you cannot choose, you have to take time. But this, this card is getting out. You already made decision. You already made decision, and this card is not going to be present this time in your, in your month of November. So you already decided that things are rolling around. So this energy of uh, not being... Uh, Decision made is out. And your present situation, your current, your current situation, current, um, what is going on right now is strength card. So, um, right now, uh, things are good for you. You are, um, The things are resolving for you, like slowly things are uh, setting in place. Things you're finding out the true and things are setting in place. The things are, the situation is, is resolving and uh, you are strong and um, you are there to um, determine to work on your, uh, on your things. What is coming into your space is the sun card. It's happiness and playfulness. There is going to be time. This is going to be month of happiness and um success and luck and playfulness and your wishes um, are going to be getting um, into manifestation uh, realize your wishes and your dreams so um, this is great card for you this is energy of sun is coming into your life this month and true as well and um, so this is um, that the card that represents you is four of cups so it's time for you to, uh, you already made a decision, it's time for you uh, to move on. 
but you still bet um i think i see this card is not really much um, influencing your month of november but this is your probably energy of the past you had uh, you were disappointed you were disappointed in your people around you in in your friends maybe in your even family things there is real cups in front of you you wasn't um ready to get it you didn't want those three cup of cups um you did want it but you didn't want it because you felt betrayed you felt that there is no anymore there um connection with you right connection and people was offering you god and people or somebody was offering you another cup but you didn't want to look at that so you was having alternative solution for solving your problems but you didn't accept that you wanted those three of cups um and you didn't want those three of cups you wanted because you had it before but you you felt betrayed and you didn't want it so you didn't um you were stuck on those three of cups there was no decision made and there was offering for one cup of cup but you didn't um you were still stuck on those three so you didn't take it but that this time i think at this time this month you are um getting aware that the truth is coming out you made decision before um you made already decision and uh, you are strong and you are um you are solving your problems you are seeing clearly for what is that and you are moving on you are um up to see alternative way including some of those three of cups so you are you are you are em embracing everything and you are moving on and um your people around you people around you have hanged men number 12 um people around you are not much in position to do much things and uh, to move much like uh, to have um action around and um sell like i don't know something like people close people around you they are kind of uh, stuck on something and they um they're in waiting then waiting they're waiting for something there is something on waiting they have to um they cannot um do something right now and right away and uh, they have to wait for to find some information and maybe see what how things are evolving what is going on before they act so there is something in waiting in regards for people around you around in your um surrounding and you hoping to uh, get magician to get magician and magician is going to be solving your problems all so that is your hope um to uh, move on forward um to be uh, your own boss to um be yourself and be um the um, one who is going to be order and things and uh, do things yourself you are hoping to get this um energy of magician this month that is your hope and your um last card your last card is word card there is um success there is some ending some like period of your time like cycle work life working cycles and this is ending of the cycle in your life and there is new beginnings so there is um period when you um transferring from one to other like this is a kind of time to moving forward in another cycle this is ending one cycle and starting new so you can see here we're going to be uh, looking at the cards again back again so you have a uh, recognition and success by people you are really like um uh, recognized you are honored by people you are celebrated you are on the horse and you are supported by knight of swords by uh, people who are true to you and who are your friends and who are your dedicated to you and um, who not going to betray you with king of swords you're receiving some information important that's going to help you in your endeavor and you can expect some um celebration and coming together with people um confusion and is getting out you decide that you made a decision you are strong and determined to do your things what you were thinking you're going to do and planning in your life this month coming is happiness success and uh, and um playfulness you accepted this it looks like alternative way including including some of those things from from those three of cups like you embraced everything this but this is the main thing you have one cup that is going to be um giving you support and and strength and um everything to go to move forward but you are included those three of cups as well so you have them all um and um you are moving forward you know what you're doing 
but people around you are uh, unwaiting. They don't know what is going to be happening. They need to see before they act. And your hope is to um, move on forward yourself, be magician, get get magician, um, get this energy to act in this month. And your last card is um, one cycle is ending for you this month and starting a new one. So you starting all over again, fresh new start, um, moving into a new cycle. This is your m month of November, my dear um, Scorpio. Be behind those cards we have two more cards we have cards from the past that represent past letter a and we have letter c this card represents future and for the past you have queen of swords queen of swords was important in your um, previous period uh, for some reason there was independency in working and um working alone on your own things and um this is earth energy like real thing working on your real things whatever you was supposed to be doing um, but mostly like feeling um, that you are satisfied with being yourself not needing much much other people around you that energy is uh, like past and what is coming in this month for you this is present and is coming in this month in the month of November there is five of ones there is some um, you're gonna be having a situation when you have to uh, deal with some other people with different opinions, you know, different things, different stuff. So you have to um, sort out things with them. Uh, how can I say? Um, there is not really fight, but there is uh, some um, different opinion, different things, different that you have to uh, work with other people. So you don't agree. There is no agreement in some things. So you have to work out with that stuff. And now we're going to look your... Um, the love life. We have love spot tarot for the love reading, and we're gonna look at those cards too. So you are underlying then energy for your love life is ten of states this month. Oh, love spot tarot. We don't need that. <coughs> and your partner has two of cups. And yourself, fortune. Your card that, that is uh, coming together with you, your card that is in connection with you, this card represents your connection with your partner. You are both into this card. You, the energy of this card represents you guys. It's five of staves. My dear Scorpio, this month you have ten of staves as... Um, Foundation for your love life and partnership, your relationship in regard to love and um, intimacy. So, uh, Ten of Staves card is um, lots of fire energy. Fire energy, it's money, it's culmination of fire energy. There was something um, going on. Um, there is um, after this, things are going to be changing. It's time for you to change. This month is going to be time when you getting in other cycle and things are changing for you this is culmination of some things this is um um you are um how, how can i say you are um you had enough of something there was something going on and you had enough and your partner had enough as well there is culmination but things are changing you are getting into a new cycle as well um you are tired you and your partner has enough of something and your partner right now have energy of two of cups. It's soulmate energy. Did your partner um, is your partner uh, getting in somebody else energy, um, getting disconnected with you or something? Um, but there is two of cups energy that is um, that I can see uh, is not connected really with m much with you. So is your partner not your your soulmate? If your partner is not your soulmate, your partner is getting soulmate energy this month. Um, and um, you yourself, you have 10. Number 10, fortune. Things are turning for you. Things are changing for you. Things for you are changing. You have this cycle that is changing this month. You have this wheel of fortune that is turning for you. You can expect luck and happiness in the soon future. So, and your partner is kind of, uh, this. your partner is getting some other way. It's getting pulled out into two of cups, into soulmate energy. 
if your partner is soulmate energy, then it's um, okay. But if not, then it's um, some um, distancing from you. So um, your cards that represent you and your partner together, that is your uh, what what you are doing with your partner together, is five of staves. There is some uh, misunderstanding again. We had here uh, the card in regular reading, five of staves, five of wands. And in love reading, we have five ones. So there is something going on <coughs> that you have to deal with. You arguing and things like that. Arguing with your partner and things like that. So um, and there is some um, protecting your opinion and things. It's not gonna be really like um, harmony this month in your life in regards to love and partnership. So there is something, um, some arguing my dear um scorpio scorpio if you like this reading please subscribe like share if you uh, did already thank you very much i wish you all the best and see you next month with new reading for you guys bye for now